kids, you're in the Mask Fan Attic with Dr. Lady once again. And as always, I hope to heck your parents don't find out. Tonight, in our never-ending search for interesting old latex Halloween masks that are of interest to collectors, tonight we present Jason, that's right, as he appeared in Jason Goes to Hell, a movie that came out in 1993. And uh, when the movie came out, this mask was created by the folks at Cinema Secrets. Now the Cinema Secrets Jason Goes to Hell mask was offered in three editions. There was, uh, well, the El Cheapo standard version, which uh, was trimmed shorter than this, and was just a latex, you know, basic latex mask. Uh, not too fancy. Good, good for the money, though. All three of them were good for the, for the price. Uh, then there was a deluxe edition, which had this extra... Uh, the neck and came down farther in the back and on the sides and had a few sparse punched in hairs. I don't know if you can see that. He's got some uh, some inserted hairs going on there. Just a few. Nice and dead looking. Looks, looks remarkably like the back of my head unfortunately. Um, and then there was the foam filled collector bust which this is. Uh, the obvious difference being it's foam filled bust. Okay so you can't wear this one. It was untrimmed. Uh, the foam was painted black on the bottom, as you can see. And uh, this one had a little nicer paint job, too. A little more detail going on with the paint scheme than either of the wearable versions. So three versions of Jason from Cinema Secrets in 1993 to coincide with the release of Jason Goes to Hell, which turned out to be not that good of a movie, but um, I really like the Jason in it. Uh, this was played by Kane Hodder, which... Uh, Many of you probably know, Kane Hodder is pretty much the fan favorite. Everybody seems to think he's the best Jason. He's the most popular guy that ever played Jason. And I like this design a lot too, with the really lumpy, blobby head. And I like the, uh, the fact that his, his hockey mask has started to rot right into his face by this time. It was a cool, scary looking Jason. And um, well, shortly after this, uh, Cinema Secrets uh, license ran out with this character and Elusive Concepts did their version next. But I like the Cinema Secrets one best. Uh, since then, there have been other, of course, a great many Jasons, but this is my favorite of the commercial Jason Goes to Hell specific Jason masks. So uh, it's, it still turns up on uh, old places like eBay and uh, you know, online uh, stores and privately owned costume businesses. And uh, I give it a big thumbs up. Jason by Cinema Secrets from Jason Goes to Hell 1993. Join us again here next time in the Mask Fan Basement? No, Attic. Attic.